My name is Brennan Keller. I'm the campus director with Call to Greatness here at Wichita State and had the joy and honor of working with Austin and Naomi for the past two years. When I came to Wichita State early on during our conversations with uh, Austin, Naomi, and I, we really dreamed a lot of saying, hey, what could happen if we um, changed one campus uh, with the love of, of Jesus? And that was really our goal from an early on uh, stage going back two years ago was really saying, hey, what could be, uh, what if, what, what could God do if we fill in the blank? And one of those things was say, seeing uh, God changed the nations through Wichita State. So I think one of the things that I really believe is if you change the campus, you can change the world. And nations have been changed, you know, through our involvement with students from India and Nepal and China and Nigeria. When I th think of the word enculturate, I think of loving people well and seeing the multiplication effect that that will take uh, in the city. So really on the college campus, when we love students well and help them see the value of making disciples and help them see the value of being involved in the community and being a leader in the community and that their voice matters and that God has a unique plan for their life, um, really what that's going to do is give them a desire to see culture change, to see nations and cities transformed and for them to come and partner alongside with other individuals who have that same vision. And so when I think of enculturate, I think of almost a social network of people hovering over a city uh, in unity uh, with the team effort of seeing a city transform. So I think college students are catching that vision at Wichita State. And for me, I'm just humbled to uh, be a small part of this endeavor of seeing Wichita become a city that's enculturated with the love of Jesus. There's this ripple effect that comes when one person chooses uh, to love well. And I think what's cool about Austin and Naomi's endeavor and their family endeavor um, together is to really see, man, what's gonna happen when they love people well and they make themselves available to uh, go where people are at, meet those people where they're at, to add value to that person in the way that that individual needs served and needs helped. And so I think what Austin and Naomi are doing is really answering the call to meet people where they're at in the city and to mobilize people and to help people see the leadership calling that they have on their lives and then to take steps together to um, very much be active and to take action on those dreams and, and ideas and, and visions that God has put in, in the hearts of so many people here in the city. And so I think Austin and Naomi are being really used as agents of change to help awaken uh, some sleeping giants, so to speak, in the city that is in, in so many uh, individuals here.